We've seen what he's done against Australia in the past. You know, he can single-handedly win games with bat or ball. He seems to me to be the, the heartbeat of their team as well. If I was Australia, I'd be worried about Ben Stokes. You know, I must admit, a month ago I was a little bit worried about how the Ashes series was going to go with no Stokes and no Archer, because those two are, you know, they're blockbuster type players that you want to watch and players that you want to commentate on, and I'm, I'm sure players that Australian fans would want to see. Uh, when they were both not there, I thought this could be a, a long, maybe quite boring summer, but now Stokes is back there. It just adds so much, I think, to the England team and adds so much to the series. Hasn't played any cricket, but you can say that same thing about a lot of people coming into this Ashes series and what's been a, a pretty unusual sort of couple of years. Without him around, they just look a completely different side. I think back to that amazing 100 he got in the second innings at Headingley. I think he was one off his first 40 odd balls. He was going to get himself locked in and set, take no risk, and then once he was set, he could open up and play. And then we've seen him other times come in and, and go right from the start. So he's got that ability to go through the gears. I don't think there'll be scars from that. I mean, there shouldn't be. I mean, it was a magnificent innings, series changing innings, really. Australia get across the line there, they'll win the series and not level the series, which was the end result. I think they'll move on pretty quickly from that and they've just got to find a way to make sure that he doesn't get away from them again and win games single-handedly again like he did in 2019. Nathan Lyons got a very good record against left-handers, as we know. We've seen him dominate some left-handers in the tour here in the past. I mean, Moen Ali couldn't lay bat on him. A lot of the Pakistani batsmen were the same, some of the Sri Lankan batsmen were the same, who you generally think are good players of spin. I've had no sort of answer against Nathan, so Nathan will be important, but I think the key to Ben Stokes, if you're a bowler, I think you have to be aggressive. He's a naturally aggressive player, and sometimes the naturally aggressive players, there's a tendency to not want to let them be aggressive, but I think you've got to counter that sometimes and take them on with, with aggression, because you know with him, you know, if you've got two back on the leg side and you bowl three or four bounce, he's not going to stand there and let them all go. He's going to play at one eventually. So I think I'd love to see Australia take him on, use the short ball early, make sure the quicks are fresh and ready to go for when Stokes comes out. You know, maybe have a quick at one end and line at the other. I think that's the, that'd be a really good way to start against him.